Hey. There seems to be a little bit of a lag. Alright, let's just wait for this to confirm that we are indeed live. Yes, we are live. Fantastic. Hello, everyone. Uh, so, just wanted to... Um, Basically, I've referenced a, a, a little poll that um, my lovely VAJ has um, posted in a couple of the groups um, that this message is going to. I think the one that I've captured in the post actually belongs to the public group. Um, and it's asking for um, what month everyone was born in. So, um, so fun facts. I uh, did a bit of Googling um, whilst having a coffee, as we all tend to do. And apparently there's been some studies, um, quite a number of international studies, um, but I've chosen one that was done in 2010 um, by an Australian researcher out of the um, Queensland University of Technology. And apparently um, your birth month is a good indicator as to whether or not, or at least there's some correlation, that, that I don't know if it's a correlation so much, but there seems to be um, some uh, patterns that suggests that if you're born earlier in the year, that you're more likely to become a professional sports person. Um, now, that's not to say that you won't become a professional sports person if you're born later in the year. Um, and they've got a couple of theories as to why that is. So um, it suggests that because of the way in Australia in particular that we start our school years. So if you are born earlier in a particular year, then you're going to be slightly more developed um, and older than um, you know people who were born later in that year in, in the same year as you. So um, theoretically, you um, you know do well in sports and so on. I don't know if that was the case. I was completely unco as a kid. I had uh, inner ear issues and so on. So just my vestibular apparatus was completely stuffed, which meant and I was just awkward because it was just like a bunch of limbs that didn't seem to go together very well. Grew very tall very quickly. So anyway, I digress. Um, point being is, um, that was a fun fact, but the reason I'm actually asked for whether or not um, what your birth month is, is actually because what I want to do is actually reach out and give those who have voted uh, a free gift. Um, and basically it's a monthly recipe pack. So, um, and obviously the month corresponds with your birth month. Um, so obviously for those who are born early in the year or already um, had their birthdays in January, February, March. Well, I've already got the recipe packs um, good to go for this year. They get done um, fresh off the press um, every month and they're usually available about third or fourth um, day of each month. So, um, and then the plan is, is that once um, those who voted, we'll keep those details. We're only asking for the birth month because we don't need to collect um, any additional information about you. It's not necessary. Um, it's only for the purposes of being able to give you a pack that corresponds with your birth month. So, as they get released for people who have birthdays from April to December, we will send those out. So yeah, make sure you vote below or comment below. If you're a bit shy, feel free to just um, to reach out to either Jay or myself and give you and, and let us know what your birth month is. And then we'll put you on the list so that we can contact you again when your recipe pack is available. All right. Thanks, everyone. Have a great day. Also, for those who are um, mad like my husband and love the Australian football rules football, it starts tonight. So good luck. Should be a thrilling game. It is a grand final rematch. Um, so I imagined um, that it should be good watching. Um, I will be finding some other meaningful activity to do rather than watching football. But uh, if that's what you're into, go for it. All right. Catch you later. Bye.